Good evening, guys. Sunday evening. Back to the work week tomorrow. Sorry. Um, okay, so let's see. Had a wonderful day today. I had my grandbabies, my oldest daughter, and um, two of my grandbabies, her children, Emma and Tristan, here today. And we had a, I taught them how to acrylic pour. And they had fun, and they did some really good work, which I'll show you when they're dry. Um, then I'll put a nice clear coat. Can't be resin, because I'm not going to go through all that, because we use silicone. So I'll just use a nice uh, clear coat of uh, sp clear spray paint. Um, anyway, today we're going to do tonight. We're going to do something fun. I'm going to do a tabletop. This is the top of the table. I bought a few of these back in the summer, and I did one. One was blue. This one's black. Uh, I did a set of black ones that I've sold already. Um, so this one's going to be a little different. And you get to come along on the journey with me. It's going to be in two parts, though, okay? Uh, so I'll try to make them as quick as can be. Spring is definitely coming because it is, uh, who knows what time it is. Dinner's over. Had a lovely dinner with my husband. And it's still light out. And he turned on the hot tub. Woo! Okay, so here we go, guys. Oh, sorry. Artworks Resin. The colors we're using today are Artie Sue's Black. It has a little bit of a shimmer in it, and that is exactly what I want. And Artie Sue's Langridge uh, Rich Gold. Okay? So, I'm just going to make up a bit of each color. I don't want to overdo it. And I'm going to use the clear as my base. So I'll just leave, oh, would help if you could see, right? I will just leave that sit there for now while I just stir up my colors. The Artie Sue's black has just enough of a shimmer in it that I want. Not sure if you can see this shimmer, but it's there. And now the gold. And by the way, guys, I know I've already posted this. The gem show was not that great. Um, there were a lot more jewelry artists and um, healing stone people there than there were what I was looking for, for you guys. Um, but there is another one coming up in May, and it's a mineral art show. And they have supposedly will have a lot of people there. But I did get some cards, and I did get... There's our goal. I did get some... Uh, two of them have accepted me as a wholesaler, so we'll see how that goes, okay? And I'll let you know what's on, we're bringing online as soon as I get them. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to heat the inside of my uh, silicone cup to loosen up. I want to use all my resin in this. See how it makes it just run? Also makes it easier to clean up my silicone cups. Yes, I did just get it on my heat gun. <coughs> but as you can see from my heat gun, everything's on it. Hence the fact that it sticks. Okay, so I'm put that there, and I'm going to heat this up because I want it to spread 
all around and now I'm going to move it around with my hand. Get it all the way around the edge. Now, I'm going to clean that off my hand because I don't want to have to change gloves yet till the last part. So, now what I'm going to do is because it's already black, that's why I wanted a black shimmer, I'm going to do just a design that will not show up that much, the black, because it's on black. The shimmer part will, but this definitely will. And I'm hoping, this is our gold, I'm hoping to get the effect from the gold that I'm looking for. Okay. Now, let's heat this back up. And what I'm doing is just moving it slightly with the heat. I'm not blow blowing it in any direction. It's doing its own thing. When you're going straight down, it spreads outwards in all directions. Not in just one particular. And it's doing exactly what I want it to. We're getting our gold threads throughout this, all the way around, okay, that's exactly what I wanted, because this is what I'm going to do now, can you see that, I'll bring you all, I'll, how about we bring you down a bit, there you go, there you go. <clears throat> okay. So now I'm changing gloves. <coughs> and I'm going to, excuse me. <coughs> excuse me, guys. Hence the hot tub. Hopefully it will get my lungs loosened up a little bit and get rid of this. Poor Lorraine. She's still got it. She's got it really bad. So, okay. These are some beautiful pieces of shell, abalone shells. If I'm wrong, she will correct me. That I got from Lorraine. She gave me these beautiful, beautiful. So what I'm going to do is in the center I'm going to build a flower with these shells. Oh, thank goodness you fell to the outside. Okay, so there's my flower, okay? Now, I have all of these ones that she gave me, and they are the sides, the insides of the shell. And what I'm going to do with them is put them all around 
the outside of this tabletop. And hopefully once they're all together, they won't float around as much. That's why I'm trying to work as fast as I can because we are going to have them wanting to move and shift. But when they don't have room, they won't have, they won't be able to, right? Right. And since you can't answer me, I'll just answer myself and pretend it is you guys, okay? I'm trying, trying to hurry this up so we can get them. And I've got just enough so I can't leave them on the floor. so pretty. I wish you could see them up close because these are just gorgeous. They're in the gold tones. Gold and ro rose gold tones. Oh no. We're covering up some. <laughs> Maybe I should have waited until it set a bit. Because they're moving, so they're getting resin inside. But that's okay because I'm going to put a clear over top, and this could be the clear that's going over top of them. It's hard to tell when the black frame is underneath. Okay, so... Obviously, I didn't uh, count out enough, so give me a sec, guys. silvery than gold, but that's okay. Because what I might do, well, I'll do it after, is switch a few around. There we go. So what I'll do is ones that have been kind of covered. Take my tweezers try to have everything as handy as possible so you're not going to look for stuff. And replace them with these ones. There we go. Okay. I'm going to leave it here. And then tomorrow I am going to do we will do a line of glitter around here in Just For You Online UK champagne color. And I just want a thin line. That's why I want it to set. I'll do a clear coat so these are covered. I'll clean up the edge right now. And we will have, in two days, we will have a very pretty tabletop, hopefully. So, there you go.
Shells are really pretty, aren't they? And see how my gold's doing? Hopefully you can tell. My gold's doing the threading. And there you go. So that was quick and easy. Well, maybe not so easy, but quick. Um, so everybody, have a great, great Sunday evening. I will see you tomorrow when we do part two. Love ya. Bye, guys.